regret minimization and the game theory. In this section, we outline the connection between regret minimization and the central concepts in game theory. We start by showing that in a two-player constant sum game, a player with external regret sublinear in T will have an average payoff that is at least the value of the game minus a vanishing error term. For a general game, we will see that if all the players use procedures with a sublinear swap regret, then they will converge to an approximate correlated equilibrium. We also show that for a player who minimizes swap regret, the frequency of playing dominated actions is vanishing. Game theoretical model. We start with the standard definitions of a game. See also chapter 1. A game G equals to the tuple M. XI SI has a finite set M of N players. Player I has a set XI of N actions and a loss function SI which maps from the multiplications of XI to the closed interval between 0 and 1 that maps the action of player i and the actions of uh, the other players to a real number. We have scaled uh, losses to the closed interval between 0 and 1. The joint action space is x equals to the multiplications of xi. We consider a player i that plays a game g for t time steps using an online procedure on at time step t Player i plays a distribution makes the action pi to the t, while the other players play the joint distribution p minus i to the t. We denote by l on to the t the loss of player i at time t, i.e. the expectations of si of x to the t for those x which is approximate to p to the t, and its cumulative loss is l on to the t equals to the summations of L on to the T, summing uh, for index T starting from 1 to capital T. It is natural to define for player I at time T the loss vector as L to the T equals to L1 to the T, L2 to the T, blah blah blah, until Ln to the T, where Lj to the T equals to the expectations of uh, Si of Xj to the T, X minus I to the T. Uh, under the condition that x minus i to the t is approximately to p minus i to the t. Namely, lj to the t is the loss player i would have observed if at time t it had played action xj. The cumulative loss of action xj in xi of Player i is lj to the t equals to the summations of lj to the t summing uh, with index t starting from 1 to t and l min to the t equals to the minima of lj to the t choosing between all possible j.